Today we're looking at the Collaborative Leadership Initiative. Since the historic MOU signing on March 1st, 2019 at Lower Fort Garry National Historic Site, the original signing place of Treaty 1 on August 3rd, 1871, 27 leaders of the CLI have been gathering to enhance the lines of communication across their boundaries and build a framework for collaboration. One of the things they've been working on is the Waste Quadrant Working Group Initiative. Even though there are many waste management sites across the region, it has a low waste diversion rate. To help increase this rate, four waste quadrant working groups were established based on recommendations included in the Regional Waste Rationalization Feasibility Study. Over the past two years, quadrant members have been gathering regularly to discuss shared solid waste issues and regional solutions that help make sustainable waste options available to everyone across the region. They've started to tackle waste issues by bringing in global, national, and local experts to educate and build capacity around shared wood, organic, and plastic waste challenges. This has included discussions on waste-related infrastructure, services, programs, greenhouse gases, and so much more. This project has been a great success due to the commitment and the expertise of all involved. Chiefs, mayors, reeves, CAOs, councillors, waste managers, land managers, environmental officers, and others. By working together, Indigenous and non-Indigenous leaders have brought to the table distinct perspectives and knowledge systems that have helped communities confront these complex challenges. Chiefs from the Southern Chiefs Organization and mayors and reeves from the Winnipeg Metropolitan Region are working together to bring distinct perspectives and knowledge systems to the table that will help their communities confront common challenges. Together, they are working towards meeting goals of SDG 6 of ensuring available and sustainable sanitation options for all across the region, and in doing so, they are setting the path towards building sustainable communities, the goal of SDG 11. Together, these leaders are showing us how to collaborate for a more sustainable region.